Hey, yo, what's poppin'? Party people, I'm that one dude, Chris from YouTube, and welcome back to Garden of Ban Ban. This time we are here with Garden of. This time we are here with Garden of Ban Ban 3. Uh, you guys have wanted it, you've been asking for it. I mean, nobody's really been asking for it, but for the sake of this bit, you guys have been knocking at my doorstep for this game, and it's finally here. I am here to deliver Garden of Ban Ban 3. We played chapters one and two. I don't know why I keep calling them chapters. I don't think they're labeled as chapters at all, but for some reason, my brain just keeps going to chapters. So I'm not gonna waste any time. I'm excited to get back into this. I know you guys are, even though a lot of you have seen this already. Uh, let's hop right into this shit. We're apparently for the Mr. Child. Is that okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, so we actually do have a new character here. Um, Queen Leap Cell. I'll, I'll be able to read it later, whatever. Emergency. Tables are missing. Why do they feel the need to take tables? Oh. Drawings. Why do they feel the need to take tables and chairs? What good does that do for anybody? Pen 15! My buddy. Was to move. I know how to play. The naughty one. Huh? Oh, the naughty ones. Like the, the babies in the pouch. Okay. Queen Bouncelia. Bounce. I'm gonna I'm gonna say that's Bouncelia. Queen Bouncelia says, jump as much as you like, but never to conclusions. The naughty ones say, finish your homework and be nice if you don't want to join us. What if I do want to join? This way to Opila Bird. I don't. No, nope, I think I'll pass. So the last time, um. I believe in in Garden of Ban Ban 2, we did a lot with Bambolina. Like, we had a lot of interactions with Bambolina. And I don't think that we'll be dealing with her much anymore. Ban Ban? Glad to see you've made it. I don't know how you did it, but then again, you survived that giant elevator crash. So, uh, I guess I shouldn't be surprised. I'm him. I'm just sweet oh, like that. Yeah. I apologize <clears throat> for hitting you over the head. I don't forgive you. In fact, it is for this reason that I believe we should not meet face to face. You see, for whatever reason, I am prone to violent instincts. And I do not trust myself to not give in to them again. I have locked myself inside of a surveillance room. That way I can help without being a danger to you. We are currently on the lowest floor to remain active before everything went awry. There are many floors below us, but they've all remained closed and abandoned for quite some time now. So just make sure not to fall. As for your children, I don't know exactly where they're being kept, but I know someone who does. Head to the aquatic sector. That's where he resides. Ooh, nope. That's Stinger Flynn. I'm gonna guess that Stinger Flynn is there. Find two remotes for your- or find two batteries for your remote. Okay, so we are in the ground sector. There's the progressive sector, the medical sector, and the arboreal aquatic sector. So I'm going to guess that we... Well, if we were in the medical sector before... Were we? I think we were in the medical sector before, right? Yeah, there's two remotes. What does this note say? I always knew I was an un unlucky person, but this is a new standard. I leave a bustling floor for, a washroom, for the washroom, and when I return, everybody's gone without a trace which would have been peaceful if it wasn't for the giant bird walking around. I doubt I can keep this quiet for much longer. My breaths are getting very heavy. What's the bird doing outside of its containment anyway? I thought they were showing off only the short purple uh, creature because we were behind on schedule. This is not how I imagined my end would be. Ooh. Rest in peace, my mans. Pen 15! Um, I think I still have a tape player. Or no, not. You have no tapes. What about the second one that I found? Was there not? I think. I thought I found a second one in the second chapter. Whatever. Can you hit the second one without hitting the wall? Okay. I don't know why I thought any different. We still got a lot to work on, guy.
Mm. Okay. All right. Before we go in there, I want to see, is this inactive? That is inactive. The dark void is making me very uncomfortable. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this darkness. Ben Ben, what do you want, boy? It just hit me that you need the key card to operate the cable car. Shouldn't be too hard to find one. Literally everyone had a copy. It's how you'd get from station to station. Okay, so you called to tell me that I needed a key card, which I kind of, I, I figured. I feel like I would have figured that out on my own. I don't think I need you. Lonely. <laughs> Good, let it be that way. Notice the janitors. Cleaner checks are required before end of shifts. Oddities are to be dropped into marked hold. So they're basically saying if you notice anything strange or out of place, don't tell anybody. Just drop it into the, drop it into this box. Dear mommy, the nice jellyfish is very strong. He carried everyone to here, but Miss Mason hates him and I don't know why. Is this our child that's writing these notes? Are we the mother trying to find our children? Bambolina, uh, 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 Jumbo Josh, and Captain Flynn. I couldn't remember his name last time, but it's, it's Captain Flynn. The cleaner has been dispatched. Please wait for results. Huh? Okay. You have no oddities to drop. So what exactly is it doing? What does it say? Oddity detected. Remove oddity to receive payment and punch out. What oddity? What? What's an oddity? Oh, are the crayons the oddities? Do I need to look up the definition of an oddity? Do I need to know what that means? Is there a reason why I did not know that the crayons were considered oddities? Oh, there's even a symbol for the... Okay. So is there any food then? Because the apple was also considered an oddity. And I just picked up a bunch of crayons. All right. I think we're good. I think it's all good in the neighborhood. Oh, do I have to do this for every... Ah! Oh! I picked up a handful of crayons. Just make it so that I drop them all in at the same time. No oddities detected. Dispensing key card. Okay. Nice. Floor three. Oh. Hey, spider. There's a nab 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 nalina. Is that you? Are you Nab Nalina? No, I think you're just Nab Nab. Oh, why do they keep adding characters? There's Nab Nab, Queen Bouncelia, Bounce, Bouncelia, the bad or the naughty ones, Slow Celine, Jumbo Josh, Bambolina, Ban Ban, Opila Bird, Captain Fiddles, Captain Fiddles, not Captain Flynn, Stinger Flynn, Sheriff Toadster, and Nab Nalina. I don't want to be here anymore. <laughs> Boop, boop, boop. Pen 15. Come here, please. Huh? Huh? Oh. What the fuck? Huh? Oh, we're moving now. Okay. Keep your guard up. Keep your guard up. Can I move it midway? Nope. I guess we're going all the way. I'm a lethal weapon. Don't you ever try to jump out at me. 10-15? Oh. How'd you get all the way over there so fast? So now we're in the progressive sector. Okay. There's a hat for pen 15 Unless that's a hat for me. Ha! We are in the medical sector now. Case update report, case six, human Gavanium, case type two, update number six, alias the devil. So I believe that the devil is Ban Ban. I 
it was probably very obvious from the jump. You know me. You should know me. Uh, if you've been watching for a while, I'm not. I'm, I'm kind of oblivious to the obvious. K6's rebellious behavior remained unchanged even after the introduction of K7. And so alternative methods were approved by management to encourage cooperation. One such method was the introduction of a newly modified Gavanium solution engineered to lower the functions of self-thinking in any cases, case two of type five, which is responsible for one's brain functions. This newly modified Gavanium solution will never be applied again and all excessive material will be locked away. So what happened? What happened to, uh, to lock this <laughs> newly modified Gavanium? Under heavy sedation, the new solution was applied to Case's system shortly after Case 6 appeared to experience excruciating stomach pain that was so aching it fell on its knees while holding its stomach. Before undergoing significant physical changes, it appears the solution was so effective at limit limiting self-thinking that Case 6 fell victim to the primitive instincts we are all so badly trying to avoid. Case is not ready for presentation. Okay, I... Oh, wait. Can I crouch? Is that... I don't know why I'm trying to break my neck to see... That looks like... I think the medical sector was where we were at before. Now, correct me if I'm wrong. I have no wood to knock on in here. Uh, but before I get to the aquatic sector, something is going to grab me or prevent me from getting there because it seems a little too easy. That would be too easy. I know that it would be too easy. You're telling me that it was that easy. Okay. Not complaining. Ah, see, I know what to do with this. Yellow glasses break. Well, yeah, I know. I remember. Hasn't been that long since I played. This way to Stinger Flynn. I, I really don't want to see any of these characters. I don't want to see anybody. I'm not a fan. They all just want to harm me. Case 13, genome Chrysiro, Chrysiro, uh, <clears throat> it is a human with Gavanium. Case type two, update one, the jellyfish. Case 13, as has happened in the beginning with most prior cases, has finally started showing signs of body and brain activity which means actual testing will be possible soon. Dormancy for two to three weeks has been observed in all prior cases when Gavanium and the genomes are first mixed and placed into a body. Case 13 is an abnormality in this aspect. Case 13's body has been only, has been only been, Case 13's body has only been in the expected dormant state for a single day and neuroactivity has already been observed. This is new. Poe's theory is this phenomenon being the direct result of the modifications applied to the Gavanium solution being used after the testing with Case 12G, which would allow for maximum learning speed. Case is not ready for presentation. Here we have yet another QR code. What does it say? It takes me to a website this time. Uh, there's a darkened image of Slow Celine. It's a it's a dark image of Slow Celine with like a very creepy smile. Do I dare push this button? You have no audio discs. Good, cool, let's keep it that way. I don't think I want to have any audio discs. Nab Nalina says, there's a right, there's a right somebody for everybody. You just need to look. <laughs> so I'm gonna have him go this way, bop, hit the wall, and then go that way. No, 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 can you, can you hit the X? Cool, thanks. And then break the glass like that. Nice. Now I'm gonna jump through. Whoop whoop! Floor three. See guys, I, I know how to play the game now. I know how to get through all the secrets. I played enough Garden of Ban Ban at this point to know how to, to know how to progress. I also have played enough horror games. No, 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 Pen15, don't go down there. Okay, good. You're stupid. I've also played enough horror games to know that I probably shouldn't be going down a dark set of stairs with a giant jellyfish that probably wants to murder me. No! It was just the lights. 
Oh my. I didn't know he was that big. Holy shit. And then I'm going to continue to go down the stairs. At this point, like, I am so sorry to anybody who may think that this is a little insensitive. I'm not a parent yet, so I, I, I can't necessarily say from a parent's perspective, but are the kids worth it? <laughs> are they worth it? Oh. 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 We're just gonna go around. I don't I don't think I actually want to see his eyes. Huh? How, how do I get around you? Oh, I might have to. Okay. Or can I just go through? Oh. Is he sleeping? I think he's sleeping. Let's keep it that way. Communication kiosk. Let's not communicate with the giant squid. I mean, jellyfish. Oh boy. Did I forget something somewhere? I guess we have to communicate with it. Oh, buddy. It's a big eye. You've had a rough day. I can tell. You would diligently wait for the moment you leave this wretched place with your child in hand. Child? I thought I had children. Not to undermine your effort, but I fear that moment may never come. I cannot let it happen. And I would gladly show you why, but after I do, you take my advice. Leave this place while you still can. Erase it from your memory. Move on and forget any of this ever happened. And I promise you, tomorrow will be a better day. Nope, I, um, despite what I said, despite what I said about the children not being worth it, I can't just, I can't just leave them behind. I at least have to try. Whoa. Okay. That's not necessarily something that I, I'm not, I'm not a fan. You guys are the cool kids. Hey, I know these guys. He's a friend from work. This is about peaceful as fuck. Why would I ever want to leave? How are you guys doing this with the water, by the way? Are you by any chance like water gods? I know these guys too. These are my OG friends. I know, oh. Down in the dark and cold depths of the facility. The circumstances force you to do things that are out of your nature. When I feel that I'm straying too far off my original course, I head to the room I found me meditating in to mentally regroup. I come to this place, and then I am reminded that what I'm fighting for is worth all of this pain and suffering. Of course, none of this is real. But it all could be. I have never had actual sun rays touch my skin. Oh, this is a bird. Can you imagine that? And I yearn for the day that they finally do. I need the children to achieve that. But do not worry. I will practice the safest of procedures. Whatever I decide to do with the adults, I will make sure to keep one alive and sane so that the surviving children are delivered to the surface safe and sound. And of course, to deliver me to where I choose to be. Oh, to live the simple life of a completely brainless jellyfish, just munching on shrimp and avoiding getting eaten by turtles all day. You never appreciate how calming it is to have no conscience until you have one. I admire your courage. So I'm giving you the chance to walk away. Take it. That way you won't lose both your life and the chance to see your child. I thought I had two children. Wait, no, I want to meet the... Oh, 
Okay, so we're obviously not going to follow his instructions. No liver, no intestines, but most importantly, no pancreas. Why do you? Why is he so obsessed with my pancreas? What am I supposed to eat when there's nothing to eat? Guess I'm going to have to look elsewhere. I don't have organs? What is happening? Oh. Uh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, I'm playing as Stinger Flynn now, I think. I never want to play this minigame ever again. I got hops, god damn, look at these hops. The main character could never. Okay, so I picked up a key card, but I can't, I can't necessarily tell you that I know exactly, what's it? I'm lost, it's dark, I can't see. I can't see, I'm, I'm lost. I can't tell you I know exactly what to do with this. Oh, now we're playing the, okay. Okay. After I literally just said that I don't want to play that mini game ever again, we have to play it. This is some bullshit. Huh? What? No! I have to arch it? It just gets worse and worse. It just gets worse and worse. <laughs> okay, that's the end of round three. Thank you. Never want to play that again. Done deal. Still have no idea what I'm doing. Wee! Wahoo! Yeah! -ha! Oh. You are not one of them. I hate this game. I hate this game. I hate you. Need to hide. They are coming. Who? Where? Where do I? Okay. For a snail named Slow Celine, you are fast, freaky fast. She worked at Jimmy John's. She worked at Jimmy John's at one point. <clears throat> Ooh, do I get to play a Sheriff Toadster now? I should really get hops now. <laughs> oh, never mind. I'm back to my normal self. Uh, okay. The place all criminals tremble when they hear about. Toadster's jail. Catch criminals and place them in jail. What? Sheriff Toadster's mission. Sheriff Toadster is catching criminals. Catch him 10 criminals to get your prize. What exactly do these criminals look like? How do I know if they're... Oh, uh, the pails. Cool. Come here, you criminal! Get on the ground! Freeze! Do I have pin 15 knock this over? Nope. Oh, I, I can somehow just reach it. Because I've got long, stretchy arms. Alright, so far it's not too difficult. So far I'm not struggling to find where to go or what to do or how to progress. I haven't been counting how many criminals I've caught. I could have all that I need. Boss room. He's not bossy, but he's the boss. Too bad he's going to jail. He's a criminal in my eyes. Oh. Do I still have my hops? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Ah. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. 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 Ah. 
This is gonna take a while. There we go. Gosh. That took way longer than it should have. Press me to start round one. What if I just don't? Follow the light trail and jump on the light as they appear. What if I just don't? What if I choose against it? Like, what are the repercussions if I just mind my own business? Oh, is that a wizard hat? Hello? Hell yeah, follow the light, okay. Press me to start round two. I don't want to play this fuck ass game. I do want to put that hat on pin 15 though. The birthday hat, the party hat is cool and all. Oh, he doesn't even have it on. He doesn't even have the party hat on. <laughs> I like that. I like that. That's kind of cute. All right. Let's get started, I guess. Bing bong bing. Bing bing bong. Bing. I don't think I did that right. I don't think I played it right. I did not play it right. Follow the light trail and jump on the lights. Yeah, I definitely didn't play it right. All right, round one. Let's get it. Bing, bing, bing. Bing, bing, bing. Bing, bing. Bong. Bing, bing, bong. Cool. Got it. Round two. This is easy. This is a kid's game. Bong, bing, bong. Give me my prize. What do I win? Nice. Get me out of here. I don't want to be in here. I hate it in here. I hate it. I hate everything about it. I hate it. Oh. Oh. These doors are open now. That's not a good thing. Oh, we don't even... He's not even customized, is he? Yeah, he's just his original color. Well, let's change that. I liked him when he was blue. And give him a wizard hat. Yes. Two more hats to collect. Pen 15. Let me take a look at you. Wait, did I... Nope, I didn't. I was supposed to press apply. <laughs> Don't mind me. <laughs> what happened to you is one of Stinger Flynn's tricks. He left for the progressive sector, but we have something more important to deal with right now. That wouldn't happen to be in Nab Nab's room, is it? Nab's room? Nope. It's open now. Which nope. Is his inside. No. He's on the hunt, and it's too dangerous to do anything in this state. No! We have to deal with No! Him. You! You deal with him! I have a solution, but you won't like it. I already don't like this plan! The medical sector, and we'll talk there. Oh, uh, so what happens if I go in here? What happens if I just run straight into his room? Oh! I should have known that was gonna happen. I don't know what I was expecting. Let me see your wizard hat. 1015. Down here. Uh, down here. Oh, it doesn't look as cool on him as I thought it would. What the fuck is that? What is... Okay. No, see. See, I thought it was going to look cool. Because it's a big-ass wizard hat. But it doesn't. So I'm going to give him the party hat back. That wizard hat is lame as fuck. The party hat is kind of lame, too. No. Eh. Kind of fits. Kind of looks right. <sighs> I wanted the wizard hat. All right, Ban Ban. I'm in the medical sector. This feels oddly familiar. Mm, nope. 
I'm not gonna go in there just yet. A whole row of Gavanium! At this point, I kind of just want to like dip my finger in and taste it just to see what the hype is all about, you know? Just to just to see what the hype is all about. Is that Nab Nab? That looks like Nab Nab. Who is that? There's somebody at this desk. Why does everything have to be so loud? Why does everything have to scare the shit out of me? Concentration table. When Nab Nab escaped, it wasn't long before workers started to disappear. Of course, precautions and trading can only get you so far, so we had to think of a more permanent solution. Nab Nalina was that solution. We had a theory that Nab Nab was as aggressive as he was due to his loneliness. Makes sense. We never got to prove his theory right, as the collapse happened during the surgery. That's where you come in. You'll be carrying out the final steps of said surgery. I don't. Javanium related procedures. Javanium. So I'm going to need you to pay very close attention to these instructions. Okay. The hard part is already done. All you need to do is mix the right concentrations and inject her with it about six times. Six. The machine with the droplet symbols is where that's done. When it's time, the screen will light up with a symbol of the needed concentration. For simplicity, the concentrations have been represented by colors. Mix and achieve the right concentration, then collect it in the syringe and give it to Nabnali. The machine with the colored pipes will occasionally shift to the wrong colors, and when that happens, use the given tongs to revert them all to their normal state of green. The buttons on the walls will also malfunction at times. When that happens, hit any ones that are lit with your drone. Anyways. The excess gevanium that you can find in the room will deplete when anything malfunctions or when a concentration is needed to be delivered. The procedure stops if any of the four depletes completely. And what happens next is never good. Only the best of us perform gevanium procedures. I... But we don't have much of a choice. I've, I've, I've completely forgotten everything that you said. I have completely forgotten everything that you said. A good doctor knows to prevent excessive gevanium from depleting completely by injecting subjects with the correctly mixed concentrations as soon as they need as soon as they're needed, turning all power suppliers back to green when they when they malfunction, punching wall buttons as soon as they need punching. Okay. Start procedure. Start start procedure. All right. Um Wait, how do I How do I get orange? Um, I think I'm confused. I don't think I exactly know. Is this the right one? Please tell me it's the right one. Okay. Uh, wait, what do I do with these? Um,. Shit. 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 Okay. Okay. All right. Calm down. Listen. Okay. Nope. Nope. I'm not. I'm not a doctor. This is not Grey's Anatomy. This is not. I'm not. I'm not the one. This shouldn't be me. <laughs> shouldn't be me. Okay. Okay. So. They need to be green. They don't need to be any other color. But then when I touched the... Oh! I'm supposed to come to this table and swap out my, um, my utensils based on what I need. So if I need to push the button, then I would use the remote. If I need to inject, then I use the injector. And if I need to fix the the those thingies, I need the, the tongs or whatever. Okay. Alright. 
I think I'm ready. I think I understand. All right, so we need blue or scion blue. We need blue and green. And then, so these need to be green. Oh no. Okay. All right. 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 You need red and red. Um. Oh, I need the remote. Gotta fix this. Okay, green. It just needs green and green. Take the injector. Grab that. Injector with that. Need this. Pin 15. Do your thing. Oh, okay. All right. I'm focused. Nothing's happening. Okay. I need the tongs. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. Don't mind that voice crack. That wasn't me. Cool, cool, cool. Grab the injector. We need Scion. So that's uh, blue and green. Drop. Pen 15. Drop. This is easy. This is a kid's game. Kid's game. Grab the injector. We need Scion again. I'm sorry if the commentary is lackluster, but I'm I'm very focused right now. Can't necessarily commentate while my life is at stake here. Yes. Yes. Yes! Red and blue. Oh, I did it! Yes! I did it! Woo! And I got the, the audio chip. Oh. Fuck me. Oh. Hi. Can you can you keep Ben or Nab Nab in check, please? I just that's all I ask. That you keep Nab Nab in check. Okay. That was tedious, but I would say that that was probably my favorite minigame once I actually got the hang of it. That was actually like it was stressful, but it was fun. You know what I mean? I actually enjoyed that one. I hope that wasn't too hard. Hey, it was fine. It was a game for children. Anyway, grab the audio disc and head back to the aquatic sector and play it on the big speaker in the lounge. Time for a spider reunion. Spider union? Spider reunion? Oh, I get it. Spider. Okay, you're not funny, Ban Ban. Should I be alert of anything? Is there any particular reason why I should, you know, have myself, have my guard up? What? Spider assembly called. Stay away from the doors and windows. Uh, okay. Nab nab. Oh. Cute. They're about to go do the dirty. Is it a spider dance? What the fuck are they doing? <laughs> At last, he's no longer miserable. I'm surprised they both weren't originally members of the mutants below. They certainly fit. This is... Hello? Ban Ban? Uh-oh. What happened? What happened? No, oh, nab nab. Nab nab. Oh, it's Stanger Flynn. Pivot get him. Pivot get him. Get his eye. 
I even made you an offer. Punch him in the deck! Accepting it is long overdue. Don't worry. I won't get rid of you or collect you just yet. I was never one to abide by wastes. An old friend needs you a lot more than I do. They too are on a path to achieve peace of mind. I already have more than enough subjects to move forward with my aspirations and my ultimate mental refinement. Okay. You just take a little nap no, I don't. To where you're I don't want to fortify my mind. I'm stronger than you. Ah! You will not put me to sleep. Oh, we riding in the whip. Hey, uh, you. You're finally awake. Hey, man, man. Can't blame you for taking a nap. Feels like we've been in this car forever. So, Singer, when are we arriving at this place called Beach? I believe we are lost. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> yep, sounds about right. OP the bird's got the right idea. Nice. You had one job and you messed that up somehow. Nab Nab is outside the car for some reason. I am struggling to locate the being who asked for your opinion. Damn! He hey, said, I. Put some music Yo! Be out here for a while. Stinger Flynn is a savage. He said, Who the fuck asked, bitch? Is this copyright? Can we turn this off? That's what I'm talking about. I, have a, I have a YouTube channel. Gila, what do you think about this? <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna need her to not to talk, like, ever again. Awesome. Hi, Captain Fiddles. Captain, what about you? Captain? Captain? He said turn that up, but like... Yeah, decent answer. Uh, turn it off, please. Can you stop vocalizing for just one second? So okay. We focus on the road? Sorry, my bad. What do you mean, focus on the road? We've been going in circles for hours. Never trust a jellyfish, am I right, Opila? This song is kind of fire, though. I'm feeling it. If your pathetic mouth utters another infuriating sentence, I will stuff your whole body in one of those two. <laughs> Could he hear me? Could he hear me? Is this one of those games that's linked to your microphone? It's very coincidental that he was, that he was talking to me. That was kind of funny. That was, I, I like that. Uh, what is that? What is that? What am I dealing with? What's happening here? It's dark. It's very dark. Light, please! Uh. Oops. Easy. It's a game for kids. Easy. Oh, uh, this probably won't be so easy. Oh, never mind. We got a platform. Whee! Oh. Whoa. No, um, can we turn that off? Why does it have to rotate? Why does it have to rotate? Hang on, I got this. I got this. Game for kids! <sighs> Too smart for this game. Now what? Oh. Oh, come on! Game for babies! Children! Okay. I have to hit at least one of them. Okay, this isn't funny anymore. <laughs> we can stop now. How the fuck am I supposed to hit these? I got one. Don't ask me how I did it. I got another one. One more. One more, baby. Let's go. There's one more. 
Ah, I got it. Game for kids. Game is rated E for everyone except me. Because I'm too smart. I'm too good. Too saucy. <sighs> yep. I have the IQ of a jellyfish. Not sure if that's a good thing or not. How high is a jellyfish's IQ? They don't have brains, so. Finally, you're breaking up. No, not you again. And that fellow over there isn't much of a talker. Plus, it's scary here. That big green guy keeps checking in on us. I think he believes we're some sort of dolls. We could use that to our advantage to try and escape. He cannot know that we're alive. So we gotta play Andy's Every coming. Time we move or change something in the room. Let's make sure that it's back to the way it was before he checks in on us. No! This way, we can inch our way towards escaping, all while he doesn't suspect a thing. This is a big puzzle words, game. From his point of view, the room must remain unchanged. When he's close, the lights change color. So run back to your chair when the lights change. I don't know where to start though, so you give it a try. I don't. I don't want to play this game. I don't want to play this game. What? You have no cubes to place. What? Oh, okay. All right, so there's the cubes. In training? Okay. What the hell? All right, close that. What am I doing? Wait, no! Quick, sit down. He's coming. Wait, wait. Was I supposed to put those blocks back? I was supposed to put those blocks back. Oh my god. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead and I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Jumbo Josh is gonna kill me. All this time, it comes full circle. Back to the no, first. That's not how the secret club's entrance is supposed to be. I know. I know. I know. I'm sorry. I know. I fucked up. I fucked up. <laughs> I fucked up. Uh... Okay, but at least I'm kind of starting to understand. So, do they have to be placed back? Okay. All right, cool. So, they just place themselves back in the correct order. You were cool. You were cool enough to enter. I'm him. That's why. Um. Okay, I, do I have enough blocks? What exactly am I doing? Like, I think I know what I'm doing, but I'm trying to figure out. <laughs> how you doing, Bambolina? No, that's not how the secret club's entrance is supposed to be. What do you mean? Oh, there's a specific. My goodness, you really have to remember this shit. So it's gray, green, red, yellow. So then I would put gray, green, red, yellow. All right, I gotta remember that somehow. Well, I don't actually have to come back here after I grab the so gray, green, red, yellow. All right, and then can I place a block here? So I'll place a block here, there, and then jump. Nope. Grab these. Grab those. They cannot be grabbed from this position. Okay, whatever. Ah, shit, 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 shit. We're good, we're good. We're good. Everything's in the exact order that's supposed to be in. No mishaps. No mistakes. 
We're good. Nice. All right. Get in the hang of it. So this room here. How do I... Got it. Okay, I grabbed all the blocks. Hey, all right. come help me solve this equation. What? What? What do you mean? You're right. Maybe now isn't the best time for education. Huh? Bamelina, stop fucking with shit. You're gonna get us in trouble. You're gonna get us killed. Stop being a mathaholic. Ah, it didn't even make sense. S smiley equals infinity? Shut the fuck up. Stop touching shit. All right. I'm sorry I yelled, but you're really, you're really killing my groove. How do I get past this? Oh, hold on. Hold on. Pen 15, do your thing. I'm scared that if I go in there, I'm scared that if I go in there, I'll be running out of time. I'm just gonna close that and wait for a second. Yeah, see, I'll wait until, I'll wait until the next round. <sighs> I'm getting it though. I cleared two out of the three rooms and everything seems to be in order. I think. I'm pretty sure. Right? We're good, right? We're chilling? All right, I got the right idea. Ah, oh, yes, yes. All right, now what? Now what? Oh, 10, 15. Do your thing. Come on, we're on time crunch here. We're on time crunch here. All right, before I do that, I don't trust it. So I'm going to wait, but I know what I'm doing. I had a little bit more time. I had a little bit more time, but it's okay. It's okay because it's already there when the time is, you know, when, when Jumbo Josh goes away, the door is already open and I don't need to waste much time grabbing whatever it is that is behind door number one. Right? Yeah, we're good. This has been stressful. All these games are so stressful. Why does everything have to be so stressful these days? What's in this door? Key card. Cool. Got it. Awesome. Close that. I don't need these blocks anymore. In training. Go, 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 go. Fuck you guys. Fuck you guys. I don't want to do this anymore. It's a solitary. Solitary confinement? I don't think I deserve it. Uh, nope. Mm -mm. Nope. Another tape. Where am I supposed to play these at? Never mind. <laughs> I just answered my own question because we're back to the we're back to the start. So now I can play the tapes on the TV. I have two tapes. Oh, Bambolina? Uh, Bambolina? What you doing? Hey. Hey, uh, Bambolina? 
What the hell was that? Oh, that happened to be Sheriff Toadster. So where am I going now? Bambolina ran off with the um with the thingy. She's gone now. Bambolina? You wanna You wanna you wanna bring the, the platform back down? Where do I go now? Progressive sector is the last place this is the last place that I Okay. No, no more games. No more games. Tartarbird, protect your loved ones. They love you back the same. Huh? This is update three for Singer Flynn. Today marks the first day that Case 13 was introduced to its human genome donor, and the results were not what was expected. In clear contrast to what occurred during the revelation day of both cases six and seven, which resulted in complete meltdowns of the cases, Case 13 assured the original genome donor that it was aware that of that it was aware that of what it was in its typical calm manner. This is despite having described identical events to what Case 6 has described regarding their bodies, such as an unexplainable immense pain that persists across their entire bodies as well as sharing similar physical attributes such as body growth and the presence of many large veins. So the veins were intentional. I thought it was just like weird with the models or whatever. We await management's decision regarding the risk of presenting a case that is this intelligent and unpredictable case to clients. No more games. <laughs> no more games, please. Egg. Oh, so I have to. Ah, oh, it's a math game. I suck at math. I fucking suck. How to tame a giant angry bird? Achieve high ground. Jump and land on subject's back. Interact mid air. You bird. Oh, okay. How about we just don't? What if we just not? I think that it would be extremely beneficial if we. Oh, there's a giant bird. Uh, okay. 1015? I think I have an idea. This involves you possibly getting hurt. I need you <laughs> to go for the baby. Really? Really? You're not gonna, you're not gonna attack the drone, but you'll attack me? Really? Deadass. Is that how we're gonna play this? Achieve high ground. How much higher can I get? How much high ground can I achieve? Seriously? You're not gonna attack the drone that just bonked your child on the head. Really? Do I solve the math problem first? Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. So one of the blue birds equals two. Does the pink bird equal zero? Because zero minus two would be zero or two. So I'm going to guess that the pink bird equals zero, the blue bird equals two, and the egg is three or one. Because it's one plus one plus one is three. Okay. So it'd be one. Two. Pink bird, I said, was zero. So that'd be one. And then pink bird minus egg is one. And then bluebird plus bluebird. So the bluebird is two. That'd be four. Four minus one is three. Four plus one is five. And. Huh? Oh no. Did I fuck this up? <laughs> I think I fucked this up. Okay. I didn't die, so that was good. So then. Oh! I'm snow. The blue bird is two. So then the pink bird is four. Okay, we're gonna do one, two, five. 
Four minus one, three. Four. Two plus one, three, and then four. Okay. Cool. That made more sense. Mr. Kebab? Where are all these characters coming from? Mr. Kebab says, be yourself no matter the cost, unlike me. Huh? It should not be moved without its costume. What costume? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> I just want to find my child and get out of here. I want to go home. I want to save my kid. Or kids. I might have multiple. I don't know anymore. Is there something through these doors that I'm supposed to be looking out for? Like a slip of paper? Hands-on testing with Case 13 has started and deemed very promising. Case 13 is even capable of fluent speech. Primitive instincts and proneness to <laughs> unwarranted hostility that were previously observed in cases seems seem to be completed completely absent from Case 13 if accidental stinging is to be disregarded. However, aggressiveness can still be presented when Case 13 is provoked or when any of its questions go unanswered. Aggressiveness never involved excessive violence or fatalities, despite Case 13 being completely aware of its impressive physical strength. Current testing involves introducing Case 13 to basic human e etiquette, such as shaking hands without stinging. The following phase of testing will involve informing will involve informing Case 13 with its mission. At this rate, Case 13 should be just as ready for the upcoming Bring a Friend Day as Case 12G. Case is not ready for presentation. Uh, I don't necessarily care to read or to scan the QR codes anymore, so. They've all been safe so far. Um, so if you wanted to pause the video and scan them yourself, then by all means. I'm not gonna tell you how to live your life. Something is gonna chase me through these doors. Sound, button, rocket. What are you trying to say to me? What are you trying to tell me? What the fuck is all of this? What is going on? Huh? Huh? Oh, uh, that's a giant turtle. Ah! Whoa, whoa, what the hell? I don't have any rockets. What are you trying to tell me? I don't, I don't have any rockets on hand. I'm so confused. All right, this button over here, if I, if I press it, what does that do? Oh, it gives me a rocket. That's what it was trying to tell me. Well, I'm dead. I'm dead anyways. I'm gonna die. Never mind. I'm good. Where do I shoot it off at? Where do I shoot said rocket? How do I shoot the rocket? So I have to wait for... I think I have to wait for the one with the long, stretchy tongue to do its thing. And then I place the rocket on it. Right? Yes! Yes! Okay! Alright, that makes sense. I get it. This is, again, a very tedious task, but I think with enough time, I, I could get it. Okay. Is it rule of threes? Is it the classic rule of threes? Come at me, bro. Come at me. Bitch! Give me that tongue, boy! Give me that tongue! Okay, we're still going. Never mind. We're done. We're done. 
Classic rule of threes. Cool. Let's never, ever, ever do that again. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I'm only gonna, I'm only gonna be mad if you put me back at the beginning of that fight. We're gonna be chill. Everything's gonna be chill if it was after the fact. If the autosave was after the fight, we're chill. No fucking way do you put me all the way back here. No way. Absolutely not. You're joking, right? Do I have to fight those things again? Okay. All right, we're chill. Everything's a-okay. Don't make me have to come back. Why am I collecting party hats? Still alive. Nothing's out to get me yet. I can smell the end. We're almost done with this chapter. Oh. We hate you. Or get bad, bad. Oh. What the hell is that? We hate you. Or get bad, bad. We hate you. Or get bad, bad. Three stones with one bird. Hand over your pancreas. Open sesame. Huh? Huh? What's that? I'm very lost right now. Hand over your pancreas. What is his obsession with pancreas? Hand over your pancreas. Three stones with one bird. Behave or get banned banned. Three stones with one bird. Get a little closer. Get a little closer. Uh, I have your child. Uh-oh. Okay, I have the high ground. I have the high ground. I have the high ground! I was supposed to interact mid-air, I think. <sighs> I'm not sure I get this. I'm not sure I understand. <laughs> this game is losing me, both with the game mechanics and the story. I, I'm very confused. Like, I'm trying to get it. I think the most that I truthfully understand about this game is that we're playing as the parent we're playing as the parent looking for their child and a bunch of these creatures down here are all test subjects but like oh why you know why i have obtained the baby i have obtained the bird child come at me bitch oh 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 um. Um. Now what? Okay. Bird riding is a new one. I'll give you that. Yeah, I'm him. What drives you forward so vigorously? Because I'm him. I refuse to accept that it's your protective parental instincts. Get him! Oh, I know. Someone has given you false hope. Get him, Pin 15. You what you want when all along they had one thing on their mind. Oh, damn. Pancreases. Yeah, what is his obsession? First, I was confused by how everything was going perfectly in your favor, despite you never being here before. Bitch, get him! And then it hit me. Someone has to have been guiding you. And as with most things, I was right. It did have help. Why aren't you getting him, pussy? Your friend here has... Helped me tremendously. Hit him in the eye! Thanks to him, I bore witness to very vital information. What information, you ask? Well, when my turn comes, 
I will simply prevent myself from turning into what he turned into. Oh. Oh. Um. Am I being chased? What's happening? Wait, what? Um. <laughs> Guys, when I tell you that the confusion is through the roof, the confusion level is like way up there. Everything's happening so fast. What? Okay, wait, so Apila Bird is supposed to cross this line first. So pink is supposed to cross that line first, and then, so that's also her line. So I can't move too fast, but I have to let her, I can't let her get in front of me. Because then there's my line. Right? Okay. Oh, we're still being chased. All right, I'll be the bird, I'll be the bird, I'll be the bird, I'll be the bird, I'll be the bird. Up the bird! A little faster, please! Up the bird! Up the bird! I'm gonna cross the line! Oh. We're gonna be here for a while. So if I keep it at a steady distance between the two, where I'm in front but she's not too far behind and vice versa, then we should be fine. She should be able to cross the line. And I should be able to speed up fast enough to where I get to it first. It's a teamwork minigame. We just gotta exact teamwork. This is very tedious though. Like, I, I don't know if it's just me. I don't know if it's just me or if there's, it, it really doesn't feel like there's much I can commentate over. Uh. You can run away, but the smell of your pancreas will always draw me to you. Why are you so obsessed with pancreas? Pancreas, pancreases. Oh boy, it's a showdown! It's a showdown! Get him! Get him! Oh! Is that where the blood is from? Was that your blood? I can't move. Wait, I thought you wanted them to fight. Did you not pit them together? Oh. Oh! Huh? Uh, a peeler bird. Damn. Okay, so. So, Jumbo Josh. And and Devil Ban Ban. Oh, hello. So Jumbo Josh and Devil Ban Ban were going at it. Stinger Flynn was like, wait, this is not what I meant for this isn't what I meant to happen. And then and then Jumbo Josh said, bitch, get out of my fight! Threw him out and then crushed uh what is it? Tartar 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 Bird or something like that? Opila Bird jumped in the mix. Find the kingdom, find the sheriff, do not let the gesture find you. Uh, you're losing me. You are losing me. Why are you coming along? Who said you could come? 1015? Why are you here? What purpose do you serve in my grandiose adventure for my children? Unless you're coming home with me after all of this, you, you don't need to be tagging along. Oh boy! End of chapter three? We done? Okay! Wow! Oh! Stretch it out everybody! Big stretch! Everybody stretch it out! Yeah, I, I, I think I'm just very confused as to what exactly is going on here. Cause... I'm gonna use some other indie games as an example. Um, Poppy Playtime, for example, is probably the biggest one that I can think of. 
we know after chapter two especially we know exactly what's happening in the game chapter one you know we find out that we were working at the facility that made all these toys and if you were paying enough attention to some of the tapes then you would get the idea that like it's the 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 toys were children who were being transformed into these toys and then chapter two definitely confirmed all of that stuff chapter two was that confirmation that we needed and then pushed even more questions out into the forefront after answering some of the questions that we had and putting those aside and with this all i can really tell you if somebody were to walk up to me and ask me hey what is garden of ban ban about i could literally only tell you that you play as a parent looking for their child in a kindergarten where they created creatures with javanium and now those creatures are hostile to you some of them don't want to help you find your children some of them want to help you but need something from you first it's i don't know we're, we're three stories in three chapters in three whatever three games in whatever you want to call it and i don't feel like i know anything i don't know if there's much else for me to understand i'm really trying to wrap my head around some stuff that i may have just missed like Ban Ban has an obsession with pancreas pancreases i don't get that it seems like they're all kind of fresh with each other like they they know they know enough about one another like Ban Ban knew that bambolina or not um Ban Ban knew that Nabnalina was what would be necessary to keep Nab Nab in check because he was just lonely. So clearly they have some sort of past, some sort of understanding with one another. But how do I as the player know that? Where is that understanding at? Well, there's one more chapter that I need to play before I'm all caught up with the Garden of Ban Ban series. Um, and then from then on, any questions that I do have, I don't know. Um, yeah, I don't know. This was a pretty long chapter though. Uh, hopefully it won't be too long for you guys. Hopefully you are able to watch it and stick around. I know my commentary was kind of mid tier. I honestly, I genuinely did not know how to commentate through half of the sections. sometimes. It was, it was like all my attention was on that one section and it was very hard for me to really say anything, especially anything funny or anything entertaining. I'm enjoying the game. The gameplay is more exciting than the story, I will say. I'm more excited about getting into the gameplay <laughs> rather than the story. And I don't think that's how it should be when you play a video game, but whatever. Anyways, I've been rambling on for way too long. I'm gonna get out of here. I love you guys. Stay safe out there. Take it easy. We will be back with Garden of Ban Ban 4 sometime this week, sometime soon. Don't know when, but we'll be back with it. Stay safe out there. Take it easy. And big body outs.